Welcome back. It's day seven of four. We have loads to talk about. Let's get right to it. <laughs> Take a look at the root loop we got today. First, let's look at green, all its leaves fell off, and these are tomatoes we harvested right before it came, just like that, when it had a bunch of crumbly leaves, that's about green. Oh wait, let's take a look at blue, I was about to say green. Unfortunately, the leaves look like this. They still feel like the bumpy layer of cardboard like I said, said in that other orange chat to me. But yo. Look at the colors on top of those leaves. Do you know what caused that, Nathan? Too much nutrients. Green, we added way too much nutrients. Blue, only a little. But luckily, we kind of time we gave it a root wash and we gave it new nutrients and new water should be fine time to grab some tomatoes There's what I really want to tr try. Oh, where is it? Where is the tomato? Oh, root has it. Let's root. Quick taste test. Sweet. I love it. Love the taste. That was good. Here's a couple of the tomatoes we harvested. They look gorgeous. We have two more to show you. They have Blossom Lot and the other two. This is Blossom Lot. That means they did get enough nutrients. On Facebook, people were talking about these covers from Green and Blue. We ended up purchasing these at Michael's. This is not an endorsement. But we just wanted everyone to know that that's where we get these from. They come in a pack of, I think, eight sheets. They're non-sticky, so they don't have any stickiness. We're just gonna take a quick peek at what it looks like underneath these, just so I can show you that the splashes still get up on there, but for the most part, it looks really good. Thank you all for watching this four part series. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and hit the notifications. See you later. Boo just found it. He gave me it. Now I'm gonna taste it. Things down for the count. Three, two, one.